thank you for joining the Northern Miner at the annual PDAC convention in Toronto. Rhythmic Solutions builds AI-powered analytics systems designed exclusively for mobile mining equipment. Here to tell us more about it is the CEO, Ross Baricivi. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me here. All right. So let's start off by asking you to please introduce us to the company and the key services it provides to the mining industry. Sure, yeah. Rhythmic Solutions is dedicated to transforming the mining industry through advanced analytics. Our core goal is to apply analytics to the load haul cycle and improve asset performance, productivity, and asset health. Mm -hmm. We do that through two products, Asset Health Analyzer and Asset Performance Analyzer. Our Asset Health Analyzer really focuses on predictive analytics, uh, identifying component issues earlier in the life cycle and allowing maintenance intervention. The Asset Performance Analyzer is focused on increasing productivity, reducing cycle times, and improving sustainability, ultimately fuel efficiency of haulage units. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's very interesting. Um, can we drill down a little bit more into these two products, uh, the Asset Performance Analyzer and the Asset Health Analyzer? How do they actually work in the field? Yeah, absolutely. So these are OEM agnostic solutions. We don't require any hardware to be deployed. We leverage data that our customers have already. Um, it's a it's cloud-based solution, and our analytics run on top of that data that, that's being collected by the customer. We push our insights right back into the customer's business systems, so they're able to leverage the insights within their current business workflows, right? Um, both Asset Health Analyzer and Asset Performance Analyzer work hand-in-hand, -hand, right? They complement each other. Where we see uh, low productivity, it's often correlated with uh, poor asset health, right? We're also able to distinguish between asset health impacts to productivity or say operating environment or operator driven impacts to total productivity. Yeah. Very interesting. Uh, so could you perhaps share with us please some recent success stories and examples from the field about uh, how you prevented failures and improving efficiencies? Yeah, absolutely. So in a few of our, our deployments, and we've deployed on three continents now, uh, we've looked at productivity as a whole. And we see examples of low productivity, upwards of 15% low productivity due to asset health issues. You know, in this example, maybe we'll drill down into an engine where turbo issues are causing low engine power, and that ultimately drives low productivity. We're able to identify even the root cause to say that engine turbo failure is a result of operator behavior where they're overriding the, the shutdown sequence and the turbo doesn't have time to spool down. So looking forward over the next 12 months, what are some of the key catalysts and strategic plans for Rhythmic? At the end of the day, we are trying to advance and, and, and further, further curate our analytics to take into account more operator driven insights, more environmental operating condition insights to get the most tonnage per dollar spent and most tonnage per hour operated. We're doing this all within our existing ecosystem and just improving the level of analytics that our customers are getting. We're collaborating with OEMs and other technology providers to leverage Rhythmics analytics within those ecosystems and on their equipment. Okay. Um, is there perhaps anything else that we should discuss that we've not specifically uh, touched on yet? Yeah, yeah, I'm excited about the future of analytics in the mining space. I think there's a lot to be gained for companies and, and I encourage those who are interested to really start diving in, reach out because just deploying this technology in a pilot way will prove demonstrable ROI and, and create the business case to move forward with, with technology like this in a production capacity. All right, thank you very much. Uh, that was Arithmic Solutions' COO, Ross Baricivi. Thank you very much for being here. Thanks for having me.